Commander, Stevens wants me to personally thank you for the job you've done here. W wait a minute. Now, Commander, we will try again. Get this plane refueled. We have another mission for you to fly. No one gets off that mountain alive. Yes, sir. Well, that was uh, pretty savage. Notice how he shoots him with a silenced handgun as well, and it is not, uh, definitely doesn't sound that suppressed. Anyway, welcome back, everybody, to Siphon Filter 2. Let's go. You've escaped the airbase holding facility, given yourself an adrenaline booster shot to stave off the effects of Siphon Filter. You must now find a way into the base control tower and then steal a chopper. If possible, observe Morgan and his operatives and uncover any agency plans you can. Airbase personnel believe you're a terrorist under quarantine and will fire if they spot you. Avoid detection and use non-lethal means to eliminate any obstacles to your goal. Teresa, come in. I'm out of the holding complex. I read you. What's your plan? First, I'm gonna find a decent silenced weapon in case I run into any agency operatives. Then I'll have to find some way to get into that air traffic control tower. After all that, finding a chopper to hit your ride on should be a piece of cake. Uh, How you holding up? I've been better. Out. Don't worry about it, Leanne. We're gonna be fine. The main gate. I want you to double time it over to admin and drive the truck for him. Who are these guys, Sarge? What the hell are they up to? Don't ask questions, Airman. Just move. Yes, sir. Yeah, they're definitely not an illegal organization that has been taken over by terrorists. All right, let's go deal with you. There we go. Good man. He just took it like a champion. Now, this is quite a long mission, actually, but it's quite a fun mission. This guy is just literally tearing ass all the way. All right, let's go hide in the bush. What took you so long? I've been waiting here for 10 minutes. Yes, sir. I'm supposed to be at the main gates clearing a shipment. If I'm late, I'll have you busted down, Airman. Sorry, sir. I'll get you there. Mm-hmm. Teresa, I've got something. I think I just saw Thomas Holman here at the base. We went through agency training together. Holman? Don't know him. He was assigned to the FEMA unit. I'm betting he'll know where the labs are. So what are you gonna do? I'm gonna get him to tell me. Okay, interesting strategy. Could work. We are gonna hide. See you later, dude. Hopefully not too much later. Let's wait for this guy to turn around. And then we're gonna jab 2,000 volts up his ass. Or however many volts. is in a taser. Probably way more than that, to be fair. Come on, buddy. There you go. Nap, nap. Nap time for you, son. We're going to grab our silent sniper rifle, which is going to be an invaluable tool. Coming up. Right. Let's go tag this guy now. This uh, level also has so many checkpoints. It's kind of insane. But I would rather have too many than not enough. Zap. One up the bum. No harm done. All right, Leanne, let's keep moving forwards. Hopefully not get a mouthful of steam. Whatever the hell that's supposed to be. Whoop. Did you hear that? Hear what? I thought I heard something. I'll go check it out. <laughs> I'm glad one of these guys has at least switched on to some degree. And in all fairness, he's going to hear us no matter what. Even if we fall as silently as a mouse. Luckily, the old siphon filter is being kept at bay for now. Come on, buddy. That's right. Oh, no. Son of a bitch. Yeah, that... Definitely getting problems with this uh, emulator when it comes to con the controls. Oh, dear. And what I mean by that is... It seems to sometimes just not register inputs. And it is a problem that I've only discovered on this emulator. 
Like, I'll be holding down uh, X, for instance, which makes you sneak. And then sometimes, randomly, the character will just stand up. Or you'll have to push a button a couple of times for it to activate. It's definitely a bit of an emulation issue. Well, I don't know whether that's because we're using a Bluetooth controller. Or why exactly that's happening. Not 100% sure. Although these problems do happen, though, they're not exactly, like, super, super common, so we're not going to worry about it too much. Alright. Let's see if we can zap this guy this time. Yink. There we go. And again, that's what I'm saying. I didn't actually release the button there. But she did briefly stand up and start running and then duck down again. It is odd. That's emulation for you. It's not quite perfect. Oop. Right, that's enough out of you. Let's keep moving. I want my chopper cleared for immediate takeoff. Put the second chopper on standby. I'll be there shortly. The rest of the cargo looks secure. Everything from Farcom West is now accounted for. Sir, the F-22 is refueled and ready for takeoff, but the payload you are waiting for hasn't gotten here yet. Your pilot seemed anxious that I tell you. That'll be all, Airman. Get on the radio and ask Holman what the delay is. We can't afford any more screw-ups. Hmm, these guys are pretty demanding, aren't they? Seems to just want everything their way. Well, unfortunately for them, that's not how we are going to be operating. Okay, we're clear. Now, Leon, I've confirmed it with Gates. The agency is going to carpet bomb the mountain with nerve gas. You've got to stop them. I know. I'm going to take out that pilot and sabotage the plane. That should buy Gabe enough time to get off the mountain with any GIs he can save. Right. I'll let him know. Out. Yeah, it's kind of unfortunate, really, that we've got Sela again. I'm trying to sneak, but she's not. Yeah. Oi. Push the button three times then. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, we've got to go kill this pilot. Kind of sucks to be him because, you know, he's not really involved. He's just doing what he's told to do. Um, yeah, kind of this bit kind of sucks, but the greater good. Unfortunately, he knows exactly what's going to happen if he fucks up. But, unfortunately for him, he had uh, locked himself into a, a no-win scenario. So, let's take a look at this F-22. A little bit pointier than it should be. But, you know, for a PS1, it's a pretty, pretty good little rendition. Although the uh, afterburners are all wrong. Now, I'm not exactly sure what we fiddle with back there. Radio Gabe and tell him I'm almost clear. He may have a ride yet. You better hurry or he's not going to need one. He's catching a train. What? I'll explain later. ETA on the chopper? I'm on my way to the tower now. I... Someone's coming. You can't let him find that pilot's body. I know. Out. Yeah, don't worry. He's going to be sleeping soon. He's going to be sleeping for a long time. Not quite eternity. Although it's pretty sad that we had to kill the pilot. Whereas this guy gets to, you know, sleep. <laughs> anyway, no time for tears. Let's keep going. Alright. Whoop. I don't think there's any enemies around here. Oh, yes there is. That's fine. Should we have to sneak past those two without any incidents? I say should. Optimistically. Now, we can actually take that light out, which probably is a good idea. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. It doesn't really matter. Nobody notices either way. 
All right, let's get our stun gun back out just for prosperity. And this is where we need to be quick. Run. There we go. Oof. Now this is a maneuver and a half. Solid Snake would be proud. I'm going to ride this all the way to the warehouse. That'll do. They do need to be careful. If you get too far over, either way, you will get spotted. How they don't actually just spot us anyway? Well, let's just say they must have the blinkers on or something. All right. Oh dear. Actually, no, I think we're good. Yeah, there they are. Holman and Morgan. Bastards. Keep walking, buddy. Keep walking. That's right. What's the holdup on that F-22 payload? It should be there. I cleared it through the gates myself. Well, let's go see what's holding them up. No! We must leave for New York now if the lab is going to have the time it needs to process this plasma. We don't have the samples from the girl yet. We can begin processing Fagan's sample and do hers when it arrives. Otherwise, the shipment will be delayed. Understood. Get to that other airstrip pronto and check on that F-22 personally. Then get over to the infirmary and see what's holding up that medic. He should be finished with her soon. Right. Should I wait here? Okay, you get the other chopper cleared and ready for takeoff. As soon as Holman gets back, I want you to personally deliver the girl's plasma to the labs. Understood. Teresa, Holman separated from the others. This may be my one chance to get to him. I'm going to make my move now. Great. Just don't kill him before you get the information, okay? Got it. Out. Hmm. So they still don't know Leon has escaped yet, I'm guessing. Which is kind of interesting. You would have thought that uh, they should really be very much aware of that. But these guys seem to be fairly incompetent, in all fairness. Which is only playing to our advantage. I could do without the escort, Airman. Sir, sorry, sir. Oh, Morgan, you are going to regret that. You're about to have a very bad day. Hello, Holman. A Holman, Standard I should silence, say. HK5. Good. Remember me? Leon, you escaped. Thank God. <laughs> Don't even try. I know what you're planning. No, I was trying to stall them, trying to find a way to get you <laughs> off the base without... You just loaded two missiles with Zarin gas payloads into an F-22 meant for the survivors of a plane crash. No, no that's not true. You're I... You're a liar, Holman. And not a very good one. Another agency course you failed in training? You want to beg for your life? You tell me where Morgan is taking that plasma. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh! I'm dying, Holman. Oh! Oh! Siphon filter is killing me, and I am running out of patience. Where are they taking Fagan's plasma? And where were they planning to take mine? I can't help you. I don't know where they're taking the plasma. All I know is I was assigned to Morgan. He said we were picking up biomaterials for transport. Transport to where? I don't know. I only know that our next assignment was to pick up some discs from the Farcom Exposition Center in New York. They don't tell me anything. I was just following orders. Yeah? Well, we were all just following orders. Just make it quick. <gasps> you have no idea what you're involved in. Maybe you'll learn if you'd live long enough. I'd suggest not going into work tomorrow. Your boss might not be as forgiving as I am. Well, considering you just shot out his leg, I'm pretty sure he's going to be in the infirmary for a while. However, that does mean they're probably going to be asking questions. So, let's make our escape whilst we can. So, Holman was a right piece of shit, but he is certainly out of the picture for now. Right, let's get a sneak on, hide behind these boxes. Good old boxes. 
nothing better to hide behind than a good solid box. Or hide inside the good solid box, you know. I mean, after all, it served Snake very well for the past couple of decades. All right, come on, buddy. That's right. There we go. Now, funny enough, this guy will actually um, notice you for some reason sometimes if you're not super, super careful. Not really sure why. He's a bit of a cheesy git, but that's fine. All right, now what we're going to want to do here is actually grab our sniper rifle. Come on, buddy. While we're young, that's it. Now, whilst he's slinking his ass around over there, we are going to take out this. Because that will kick us in the balls if we're not careful. Now, let's take this guy out whilst we can. Hey, fuckface. Time for nap time. Time for nap time. Yeah, that works. We'll roll with it. All right, let's get this thing rolling. Again, we're not going to question how this happens. <laughs> we're just going to sit back and enjoy it. That's going to go get those MPs off our ass anyway. All right, not bad. Not bad. Now, let's go get some codes from the tower. And then... Go steal a chopper. No, sir. Agent Holman has not checked in yet. The F-22 has been cleared for takeoff. Priority one. Personnel have not seen the hangar yet. I'll find out, sir. Hey, Sarge. These feds are getting pretty antsy out here. One of them is cleared for takeoff. Hold on. Agent Falcon, your chopper is cleared for immediate departure. The F-22 has not cleared its hangar yet. If your other agent is at the airstrip, you can fly directly there and pick him up. Copy. Out. Oh, come on, really? Son of a... Son of a bitch. See, sometimes that will actually, like, auto-lock on. Sometimes it doesn't. I guess we were just a little bit further out on the angle there. But that's okay. Yeah, that F-22 is not going anywhere, friend. Just saying. Your chopper is cleared for immediate departure. The F-22 has not cleared its hangar yet. If your other agent is at the airstrip, you can fly directly there and pick him up. Copy? Out. Eat my ass. Hey, come here and take a look at this. Now, yeah, so you need to take both of these guys out because if you just run here to grab the uh, codes, he's going to spot you. And if you take him out but leave him still going because he won't spot you but eventually he's going to talk to that bloke when he realizes he's not there you're going to have a bad time so you do actually have to take both of them out i've got a transponder frequency of the downed plane now all you need is that ride i think the agency's provided for me on that one falcon's chopper is cleared for takeoff if i stop him i can take the chopper and no one's the wiser nice plan good luck Damn, she's really not sounding that great anymore. But that's okay. It is what it is. I'm sure there's enough juice left in her to get this bit done at the very least. All right, let's go finish this mission. As you can see, it's quite a long mission compared to most of them so far. There are a few that have some substance to them. All right, I'm through waiting. You stay here. When Agent Holman arrives, tell him to contact me directly and I'll give him further instructions. Yes, sir. All right. Let's go take this airman out. Nap time. There you go. Let's tuck him into bed. And this sack of shit over here. We're just going to light his ass up. Because he can die. And that is a massive, massive rear rotor. It's kind of insane, actually. Teresa, I've got a ride and clearance all the way to the crash site. GSAT's reporting a huge fire, probably caused by the crash, but who knows? Thick smoke is shutting down all flights into the area, so be careful. <coughs> well, considering what those guys could have been breathing, 
A little smoke won't hurt him. Catch yeah. me through to Gabe and wish me luck. You got it. Yeah, Leanne's kind of saved a lot of people. Anyway, guys, that's going to have to do it for now. Thank you very much for watching. When we come back, well, we're going to go see what Gaben's up to. Taking a train, apparently. Hmm. Till then, guys. Thanks for watching.